Okay, let's create account page layouts together. So the first one, we want to create a page layout for the account object and it's going to be named customer account layout. So I'm going to copy that. Let's head over to our setup and then object manager, the account object, page layouts, and make a new one, new page layout. I'm going to do customer account layout and copy it from the account layout there and hit save. Okay. Now we need to create a section, a section just above the additional information and do this detail sales, re sales region. So let's do a section just above additional information here. Okay, like that. Name this sales region and two columns left to right. Hit OK. Next, another section, we're going to call the support plan information. So we are going to drag another just below the sales region. Support plan information, same thing, two column left, right. Let's confirm two column left, right, and hit OK. So we have two new section here. Now arrange the fields. From the account information section, drag the region field onto the left of sales region, so region and zone, right? Region and zone. So you can search it here. Region. Oh, it's already, it's already on the page, so I just need to drag it. So here. So region, I'm going to put it on the left, and zone, I'm going to put it on the right. So you can drag it there, and then has support plan into the left column of new support. So has support plan is here. On the left column, you drag it there, all right? So it's going to look like this, sales region and support plan expiration date on the right side. Support plan expiration date on the right side. So now it looks like this, there's four fields on two sections, okay? Okay, next, make the rating field required. Make the rating field required. So you can search rating here and click on it, boom. It's going to show you, boom, yellow, right? Now hit the wrench. It's required. You have to fill this in whenever you're editing this record. So I'm going to do quick save. Quick save means you save it and you're still on here. If you hit save, you're going to get out from the edit mode, which you don't want while you're still editing it. Okay. And then do not call column. Uh, add the do not call column to the contact related list. So to do that, to do that, you go to the related list here, boom, and then here, wrench, boom, and then do not call, bring it to the right, boom, and boom. You got that. Save that for now. Now move the opportunities related list to the top. Okay, boom. Opportunities, you can drag it. Just put your mouse over here, this here, drag it to the very top, boom. Oops, not yet. No boom yet. There, <laughs> boom. Quick save. Okay, all right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Preview the layout and save it as customer account layout. Customer account layout. Okay, I'm just going to hit preview as custom, custom um, sales profile. So it's going to look like that. We have sales region, support plan information there. Okay. Okay, now we're done. I'm going to hit save. So we're back here. So we have customer account layout created. So next up, assign the customer account layout to the appropriate record type. Okay, let's assign it now. Now, 
page layout assignment and we are going to edit assignment okay click the top of the customer account column here you click on there and then select customer account layout as page layout to use customer account layout boom okay now you selected that now you can save that so that's it that's how you assigned that so now we are going to create a new account layout called partner account layout here partner account layout copy that make a new one I'm gonna close that choose from the account layout and then partner account layout save and now remove the rating region zone has support plan and support plan um, and support plan expiration date field so we are going to remove that all those fields here remove that remove that remove that and remove that okay that's basically it now we're going to save that and we are going to assign to partner account column okay we are going to assign this um, page layout assignment so we are going to edit so for partner account there we are going to change that to partner account layout boom save And that's pretty much it so we have two new page layout one is for displaying customer account records the next one is to display partner account records all right so let's verify the steps and i will see you on the next video which is enable account field history tracking bada bing bada boom hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the salesforce app exchange and do yourself a favor like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it don't take my word watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself bada bing bada boom